Hello! So I often style my hair in a spiky way. But because of the fact the hair grows, it's now a little bit too long for me to style it the way I want it, and a haircut is just around the corner. But before it gets a lot shorter, I would like to spike it in a different way. With putting up actual spikes. And I thought it would be fun if I showed you how to do it. Because in the end, it's not really that hard. And because it would look really awesome as a time lapse. So first off, you need to keep in mind that the shorter hair you got, the more spikes it has to be made into. And that is almost completely for the looks, because it's going to be hard at making thicker spikes look good out of shorter hair. If you have a little bit longer hair though, it doesn't really matter. Second off is that you're going to need 4 slash 5 of the following. A tight comb, strong hairspray, and don't use wax or that stuff, because that's only going to weigh your hair down. Blow dryer. A mirror with either a little one besides or one with side mirrors. Cause you simply need to see your whole head. And if you have curl or waves in your hair, you can also use a straightener. Now the third and final thing. It's not that you smell bad, but you should probably take a shower. Cause your hair, at least what I found, will style a little bit better if it's clean. So I'll jump in the shower right now. Ooh. I need a serious haircut. And because my hair is a little bit wavy, I'm going to flatten it with a straightener. Now to make spikes, you really do only need to know one thing. And that is how to make one spike. So you take a portion of your hair that you want to make a spike out of. And if your hair is extremely puffy like mine, you can always take something to set it up with. Then you take a comb and back comb it. And now it should pretty much stand up on its own. Next you take your hairspray and you spray the bottom. Smear it out. Now grab and pull your scalp a little bit and blow it till it gets hard. And don't make any fun jokes now. So next you spray the top, work that in and blow it dry. And there we go. That's how to make one spike. Now I suggest that you make a mohawk out of this just so you have a center line to work from. And when you get to the back and can't see, you take your side mirrors. And there we go. That wasn't so hard now, was it? Take your time with it and accept the fact that it just won't look the same every time you do it. I'm Tom Victor Shiron and thanks for watching.